be showing you guys some secret stuff that I've been finding the past six months of my time making music. First plugin is called Factoid. All honesty, I want a partnership with these guys. These guys only have like 200 followers on Instagram. Cheap plugins and they're really dope. Like, come on, bro. That's a steal. Okay, so basically it's just a stem layer time randomizer. So let's say I get a phrase from my boy Keon. <laughs> Got this cool guitar, right? You know what I'm saying? Like, you put it in here, you press time randomize, it just layers it all up. And then what I'm doing over here is I'm just playing with the layers. So I take the layers out. You could have just had a layer like this. You just have one layer like this. And then you have different frequencies to play with. So it's just playing with the whole how it's arranged and how the timing is and um if i just want to have that part i just want to take that part but if i want to take that part away i have nothing but then i what if i want the, the percussion only it's a stem extractor too this has to be the sauciest plugin that keon found and put me on sorry keon i'm showing everybody i told y'all bro the title of this video i shouldn't be showing y'all this i'm not even gonna edit this um, this is literally so much sauce, bro, because it literally takes away the stems. You could like play with this too. Sauciest plugin of 2025. We now we not in 2024 no more. With this, we in 2025. I'm I'm praying for whoever's seeing this because you about to do some whimsical work if that's even a real word, bro. But yeah, bro, like I said, enjoy factoid, man. Uh make new phrases with this. My boy Straight Cash made a joke of like, I could just take your phrases and just make new ones. <laughs> Please don't do that. <laughs> On top of that, Factoid is like super cheap too. So these guys are really, really, really like giving away the sauce. The next one is called Factor Synth. Yeah, that's right, bro. I'm showing all the sauce today, bro. I'm sorry for whoever's watching these. And you're like, damn, bro. Like you just spilled. Pause. <laughs> So I have my phrase, I have one phrase right here, then I have another phrase right here. So this time you could have two things and combine and mix them together. You play with these to add on your frequencies and to randomize that, mix them up, yada, yada, yada. So you see how I'm just like... I'm trying to figure out... Okay, so it sounds... I don't even... To be honest, guys, I don't know exactly how to use these. Um, but I just play around with a bunch of the textures. So like, what if I just want to have this? Yeah, I'm trying to figure out where my, um, this phrase went. Like, where did this even go, bro? What's going on, cuh? Jesus, this has created a whole new thing. Let's put it, let's like play with the pitch again. And I ain't gonna lie, y'all. Factor Synth, I don't know why, but it takes up not a lot of CPU, but it makes my freaking, com not my computer, but FL just like when you're starting to play stuff, like FL frame rate just goes crazy. Um, Okay, so what if I just turn the sound shifter up? Like, boom. You feel? What about this? You got something new, got something completely new. And so what you do is you just add frequencies. And you just keep, keep adding frequencies. And you can just play around with it. Randomize the pan if you want to. Turn up some shapes if you want to, like just, it's a frequency stem layer randomizer and so i like i said these are the two phrases right here and you can only hear like the the cadence of the rhythm of it just completely turn it into something new now obviously like i just said it's gonna have the same cadence and rhythm to it but that should be a really good start to what you're trying to flip like i said guys i've never seen anybody post on these except the people and Mond themselves on YouTube. So, um, yeah. Uh, is the donations open in the comment section? Because I wouldn't mind a few donations. I'm just playing, y'all. Listen. Factor Synth and Factoid are probably the sauciest plugins. That's why I saved the best for first. You know what I'm saying? So, 
Thanks for watching. Now I'm playing. I got like a few more to show y'all. This is actually going to be a very short video. All right, my bad, y'all. The next one has to be the Crow Hill Company plugins. Bro, Keon, I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> I know my boys are going to be like, dude, what is wrong with you? Dude, y'all, there's plenty of VSTs to share, bro. So listen, bro, these, this is called Dot Allison. And let me drag in like a dope MIDI. Whoa. I didn't even know you could do that. The shimmer. Yeah, so Dot Allison is just like some really cool background vocals you can add to your stuff. Ooh. Ooh. Bro, but it's fi though. It's fi. It really is. Like, take my word for it. This is pretty cheap too. Cost you only about a hundred dollars. Now I'm playing. I don't even know how much it is, bro. Hey. Listen. VST companies watching this. I'm sorry, but listen, y'all. What you need to do is you need to find a group of friends and you split. They got even the stuff you can play with. Oh my gosh, I'm rendering that. That's like a starter I could send out. That's really dope, bro. Like, you know, don't waste so much money on, not waste, but don't spend so much money on vocal singers and instead get Dot Allison. Now, I'm pretty sure y'all have millions of string plugins. I know I do. And you're probably like, bro, another string plugin? Like, but you guys gotta trust me on this. Oh, I forgot I had halftime on. I was like, why does that sound so cool? Bro, I don't know what's going on tonight, but I'm just making starters on accident. Hey, bro, starter pack, DM me. But yeah, bro, this string memorations has really nice um, articulated strings. So if you hold it for a long time. I don't know what that was, but it sounded like some horror movie, like coming out of the closet. Wait, hold on. Nah, nah, I did not mean to say that. You know what I mean, bro. Like you coming around the corner <laughs> and they even got a bunch of like different type of stuff. Oh. That is so nasty. That, yo, I'm, I'm exporting that again. I don't know if y'all got like an ear for strings, bro. But when I hear some expression and articulation and VSTs, I'm like, yes, take my money here, bro. Like for real, for real, bro. Like it's so easy to make a VSD sound robotic. But when it starts to sound realistic, that's like AI coming into the world. It's kind of dangerous, bro. I really shouldn't have to say any more Crow Hill VSTs. Them VSTs have been used by Hans Zimmer, bro. What do you want me to say, bro? Hey, man, I'm going to tell y'all this one. A, lo a lot of people still sleep on the Cymatics plugins, which I don't really understand. <laughs> My boy know how to play guitar. And if you want these phrases, bro, go shout out Keon Key Major, bro. Like, they dropped the whole cool Coding Files series. Coding Files trilogy type beat. Lotus on Crab. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Dude, is that another starter I just made? Hey, yo. Whoa, what was that? I like that progression. Make your own presets on here too, bro. These, I know that all the cool French pedal board producers 
Yeah, I know y'all actually have real pedals, but we on to y'all now, bro. We got Cymatics Illusion. I was actually at Stephen Crib in Atlanta, and hey, y'all, man, listen, I'm not promoting, but like I just said, bro, they, they got some crazy stuff on the way, bro. You know what I'm saying? I've never actually seen anybody, right, recreate the Therme as good as these guys, bro. No glaze. I'm just trying to say, I'll be putting everybody on. I got y'all with a new free plugins video next, bro, but this is for all my people that's like, you know what I'm saying, summer job just hit or graduation just hit. They just got some bread from their grandparents. They're looking to make some good music. They probably just got like $100, $200, bro. They're looking to like invest, bro. This is where y'all need to go, bro. You want to sound design? You want to make some cool melodies? You know what I'm saying? Like, this is just a dope video. You got this string phrase, right? This is cool and all, but I kind of want to turn it into a texture. Well, pay no mind, my boy. Unfiltered Audio Silo is here to do the job. Now, if y'all want to talk about unfiltered audio, these dudes really got no filter because look what it's about to make. That's cool to me. I don't know about y'all, bro. And uh, it's like portal on crack, bro. What is going on right now? Like, bro, I did not ask for all that, bro. Like, what is all this going on? What? Yep, definitely gonna save that for later. Uh -uh -uh. We got a fire. You started. We already know how to work with, man. Quick little intervention. Like, what's a starter like? Hey, man, you want to collaborate on some melodies with your homies? Send them a little piano. Send them a little pad. Let them add on top of it. Flip it. There you go. You got a collaboration melody. You'd be surprised how many people didn't know that, but it's all good. Starters are kind of like new-ish, but it's just unfinished projects you just send to your people. All right, so I got a one shot from my boy June DAP, correct? <laughs> Probably like, what is this? What did you just load up? And why is the UI so sick? I ain't gonna lie, y'all. A good plugin really matters because the UI too, bro. Like, this is like 4K 60 frames per second right now. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, see, that completely missed my boy. That was kind of like just a uh, ambience maker. I ain't gonna lie. Beam is dope, but you really gotta mess with the presets though. Like Beam is like a go-to for like a one sounding type of thing because it does so much that when you have a full MIDI, it's gonna do so much to it to where it's just like, there, it might be too much. So if you have like a simple one shot or a phrase or a melody that you kind of want to add some effect to, Beam is probably the perfect plugin. I don't know if y'all ever heard of these, but I know Nico Baran, you know, since everybody trying to get that Nico Baran sauce, like, yeah, let me get that vocal sauce. Let me get them scent like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it got, this is, he has this in real life. But the difference between this and the real life pedal is that the real life pedal costs literally like three bands, bro. Three bands, bro. I think more for a, for a Moog plugin. I'm like, Nico Baran, how much money do you got, bro? But yeah, this really kind of emulates it. You know what I'm saying? Let's take away the beam. It really messes up the sound, bro. I know this is definitely what he'd be using on his vocals, but he got the real life version. You can't beat the real life version, bro. 
that's really all the cool plugins that I got for y'all. I know it wasn't much, but I ain't really been in my like searching bag in terms of plugins, bro. Like that's London on the track, bro. London on the track got all the plugins in the world, bro. Like he need to make a video on the best plugins. Not me. He retired me ever since I saw his laptop, bro. Like, man. Anyway, y'all. Yeah, bro. Like, shout out to everybody who's really trying to invest, bro. These are some really dope finds. And I'm going to make a free VST video in the future. Because I know there's definitely been some new hard ones that's been dropping. Just like these. So, yeah, man. Um, Like I said, I think my favorite one out of all these has to be the Anmond plugins in the beginning. Or An Anmond or whatever, bro. Shout out to y'all. Uh, The Factoid and the Factory Synth, bro, is just too fire, bro. It's just like there's unlimited possibilities with what you can create. And how many times that you can flip something. I feel like that we, as producers and creatives, we love, like, a good randomizer button. We love, like, a good, like, suspense button. Because you never know what might come out of it. There's something called happy accidents for a reason. That's why pedals are so dope. Because it's so random. You'll never know what you might get. And I feel like that's really exciting within music itself. So, um, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching, bro. If you watched till the end, thank you for tuning in. Talk to you guys later. Love y'all. Peace.